Hola, Professor Candido here with another sample I created to help you understand how to use the print function in Python to create column oriented output. So what I did up here is I prompt or ask for the input of a name and a salary, then I ask for a second name and a second salary. And you ask why do I want two sets of names and two sets of salary is to show you like a little report and how everything lines up nicely. So notice I do an input, give me a name, because I want it to be a string, and the input function returns a string, I just put the value here. But because I need a float, I take, give me a salary, whatever they type in, I convert to a float and store it in a float, like salary. So let's come down here. See this um, identifier, or format specifier? Right here, we're saying we want a left justified column. Left means a line to the left that will be text and we're going to put the name so we use the print function comma means we want a second output which is format f salary which is what they entered and I want 15 column width with a thousand separator a decimal point and two decimal positions and I do the same thing down here so again I let's run the program and then you can see how it works so I'm going to do run module here comes my run window, and I'm going to put in my name, and I'm going to give myself a salary of 45623 and just say I make some partial pennies. Ah, uh, let's make it 79. Then I'm going to put in my moose, my dog, my moose's name, and he makes far more money than I do. All right, see how the names are lined up here? and the output for the um, salary is nicely aligned. So let me do this so you can uh, see what it does. And I'm going to just adjust this a little bit here and there. All right, so let's look at the formatting. It doesn't matter which one we look at. We'll look here. See, I say 20. You have to type it in just like this. And just like this means just like this. You single quote, the curly brace, the colon 20, the right curly brace and single quote. Exactly, you can't put extra spaces, nothing else. So what that gave me was 20 characters right here. Well, actually to about here, I'd say. And notice when I have Brian, it actually filled it with 15 blanks to create a column. Moose K. Candido is obviously longer than Brian and Python put the number of spaces that are needed to get it to 20. Over here, we say we want a column that's 15. Now let's use this one, which would be about to here. We want a thousand separator, a decimal point, and two decimal positions. Notice how 0.779 got rounded up to 78. It is that simple to do. But remember, you have to put in exactly like this, no extra spaces, and you're good to go.